Hey everyone, let's learn how to use the Liquify Bloat tool inside of On One Photo Raw. Inside of Photo Raw, let's use the Liquify tools to enhance this surfer image and enlarge him a bit in the frame. So let's head over here to the tool well and I'll grab the Liquify tools. Now in our Liquify tools, oops, let me lower this brush size a bit. And up here in our top tool modifier bar, we have these three different tools. We have our Liquify push tool, we have our liquify bloat tool, and our liquify pinch tool. Let's focus on this middle one, the liquify bloat tool. This is great for enlarging things in your image and magnifying them to make them a bit more prominent or to round them out a bit. So what I'm going to do really quickly is just show you how it works in a more unnatural way. So I'm just going to keep my brush size at 300 and I'll make sure my pressure is at 100. Then I'm just going to smear this around a little bit and you can see it's sort of enlarging these areas. But it looks really unnatural and sort of cartoonish. So to use this in a more realistic way, let's head up here to our size and to increase the brush size or decrease the brush size really quickly, we can use the bracket keys on our keyboard. The right bracket will increase the size and the left bracket will decrease the size. So in our pressure, let's make sure it's at 100. I typically keep this at 100 whenever I'm using it, but if you want to use less pressure, you can lower that here. Then with this size, I'm going to increase the size quite a bit to about 900 or 1,000. And because it's very intense, I only wanna click on the area I'm enlarging for just a, a second, you know, not that long at all, just a click on your mouse should do it. So I'm just going to put the middle of the brush over the surfer's face and I'll just click down. And then I'll do the same thing down here by a surfboard. And then this area where the reflection is on the water. And once you've painted on the liquify tool into different sections, you can see the different sections are previewed whenever you hover over them. And you can select those sections, you can move them around, and you can also increase the size of those sections. I'll just use the bracket keys on my keyboard. So I'll just do that with those other sections. So now let's head up here to the top to a modifier bar, and I'm going to enable this show mesh option. When I have this enabled, it's going to show me all of the morphing and skewing of the image. Where the original image is, we have these straight lines on the grid. And wherever we morph it with the liquify tool, you can see that with the bending of the lines. So let's head up here and I'll disable that. And let's just check out the before and after here. And that liquify tool is doing a great job of just enlarging that surfer and making him a bit more prominent in the sink. 